Hey guys, Johnny Brotherton here. We all value reason and logic, and with the amount of discussions and debate happening every single day, I thought it might not be a bad idea to do a quick refresher on the three logical absolutes. The first one's rather simple. A tree is a tree. A tree is not not a tree. You could replace tree with this with anything. A bird. A bird is a bird. A bird is not not a bird. Uh, it's, the first law is called the law of identity and basically states that something is what it is and it's not what it's not. Pretty simple. The second is the law of non-contradiction and that states that something cannot be both true and false at the same time. To take for example our, our tree from earlier, a tree cannot be both a tree and not a tree. That would be a contradiction. Uh, same thing with our bird. A bird cannot be a bird and not a bird at the same time. The last is actually my personal favorite of these because what it does is it forces you to make a decision on one thing or another. Because the third law states that a statement is either true or false. Your premise cannot be in the middle. It, this, that's, they call it the excluded middle, the law of excluded middle. So if I say that uh, this tree is a tree, that statement's either true or false. There is no middle ground. And this applies to just about everything. So make sure that you remember your logical absolutes when you're putting together a formal argument. It's going to be very crucial to make sure that your premises are sound and that your logical argument uh, is complete and makes sense. So if you like videos like these, subscribe to us on YouTube, Atheist Analysis, and uh, we'll do some more.